This position doesn't appear to be critical, but it teaches us a big lesson. How to develop our pieces so they work together. You should not put pieces anywhere. G6. We are going to put our bishop on g7 and together with c5 pawn and knight on c6 fight for the control of d4 square. If we developed our knight on f6 then the knight would stay in the way of g7 bishop. Instead this knight wants to go on e7 after we play e6. So the plan is to play bishop g7, e6, knight e7, rook b8, b5, b4 which would loosen up this whole diagonal and finally we would jump with the knight on d4 and the other knight on c6 to support that knight. If white plays f4 in the future starting a kingside attack, we can play f5. Thanks for watching, hit that like button and see you in the next video.